This is our latest generation EC equipment. EC stands for electrocoagulation, and it's a technology that we have patented that does really well with removing ammonia and, and, taking, and controlling bacteria. So we have uh, mechanical filters here to remove the waste, and then we have the EC unit that removes the ammonia and, and controls the bacteria. The way it does that, and this is talked about in our patent, the, as the ammonia goes through the chamber, shown over here in the black box over here, the ammonia, the chlorine is taken out of the water, combines with the ammonia, and forms chloramine. The chloramine then is taken out downstream by a carbon filter. And so all of this recycles through the grout tanks. We're setting this up right now to handle a whole row of grout tanks. Uh, so this will handle 10 different uh, grout tanks. I want to talk a little bit about biosecurity. It's very important to us, of course. So first of all, the hatchery does extensive testing on the PLs before they ship to us. Once we get the PLs, we put them into a nursery tank for a number of weeks so we can observe them, make sure everything's fine before we move them out to the grout area. For the building itself, we'll be having foot baths and controlled access and limit the number of people that come in. Okay, we're building this, we have this uh, pilot plant that we're retrofitting to be a production facility. Our plan is to build a production facility we call a model production facility next to the facility here. We have 37 acres of land here, so we have plenty of room to build additional facilities. The next facility will be larger, it will to produce 6,000 pounds per week, and then it'll go right next to this facility. We're calling that the model facility because that's what we're planning to use as a basis when we expand to other cities. So we'll build the next one, 6,000 pounds per week facility next to us, and then we'll replicate that in other cities.